previously on Stardew Valley. Well, I filled my inventory with fish for tomorrow. Then I will be able to take them all to the community center. Oh, it's 12 a.m. One... Oh, goodness. This is just like real life. <laughs> oh, I got the letter about the egg festival. Yay! Uh, buddy, where's the other chicken? Hmm. Um. The yard bird is here. Oh, uh, here's Trogwort. Yay, Trogwort! And I will walk 1,000 more. Haha. Haha. Ha. Hit song reference. Yeah, I don't remember who that song is by. I associate it with Lord of the Rings for some reason. I don't- I don't know why. I really like the Minecraft cover of it, mm -hmm. called 5,000 Chunks. It's actually called 500 Chunks, and the original song is by the Proclaimers, if anyone cares. That is a pretty far distance. It's about a villager who gets his house stolen, and he will walk all of that distance to find the wood that made up his house. Oh, our carrots are ready! Yay! Fun fact, uh, you can feed carrots to horses in this game, and they'll go faster. That's just like real life! Yeah, I know about horses. Well, I'm off oh, to drop off a bunch of this fish at the community center. Okay, I might go fishing in a minute. You can get cat trees in the new update for your house. Aww. We've mm. got a sunfish. It's so mean that all of Haley's loved gifts are, um, summer things, but her birthday is in spring, so you can't get her any loved things before her birthday in year one. A cruel joke by Concerned Ape. Now we only need to catch a sturgeon to complete the lake fish bundle. Yay! I'll go work on that. I'm the best fisher in this town. Yeah. If you don't look at any other fisher. I'm a fisher in the town. We gotta make sure we save a potato and a cauliflower to give to the spring crops bundle. The advantage of completing all of these bundles is still a mystery to me because I have not gotten that far into the game yet in any save, but B, what does completing the bundles do? It restores the community center. It shows the Junimos that um, there's still interest in the town's community, I think, and they restore the community center, or just the town does it. And it gives you uh, some new location? And some new abilities? I don't know, I've only done it once. Oh, okay. And it was like two years ago, so... It makes a nice building. Yay! It also makes it so all the stores are open less often, because people are at the community center. <laughs> Which fish did we need? Uh, we needed a sturgeon in the lake. Okay. Well, I got a largemouth bass. Whoa, Where that's the rarest fish in the game! I'm gonna give this largemouth bass to Linus. Linus is an outdoorsy guy. We're supposed to make a furnace, but in order to make a furnace, you need 20 copper ore. So, back to the mines it is. Do we not have any in our chests? We have three. How's the fishing coming? It's going. Can you tell which rocks give you ore? Um, I think the copper ones have little orange chunks sticking out of them. Because as we know, copper definitely stays orange forever when exposed to air. Okay, I've got two copper ore so far. I got three copper ore from a treasure chest fishing. Cool! Oh no, I've made a very, very bad mistake. Uh, did you go to the mines? I, I entered the mines, and I don't have a weapon. I can come help in a minute, though I'm almost out of ener energy. I'm- I'm sure this will go perfectly fine. Yeah, you've got this. I believe in you. Oh no. Uh, two slimes are mad at me. This is fine. I threw them for a loop. I got a geode! Well, the slimes have defeated me, so I'm leaving with three copper ore, quartz, and a geode. Let's pop down to the saloon, because it's Friday night, so there'll be a bunch of people there. Oh, ah, everyone's on top of each other. This is alarming. Aw, Marnie's checking in on Marmalade. Yes, Marmalade is doing great.
And I will walk 10,000 more. Yeah, to get the wood that your house is made of. Yes, exactly. I got level 1 fishing and level 1 foraging. Awesome. It's the egg festival today! Woohoo! There's a randomized event that happens one day and every spring or summer, I don't remember. And I'm very excited for it to happen. Do I get to know what it is? No, I think it should be a surprise. Okay. It's an environmental occurrence. Oh. Hi, Yardbird. Hi, Trogwart. We've got two eggs. And for the viewers at home, the amount of hearts you have with your birds means you get better eggs. So that's why you pet them every day. Also because they're cute and adorable, but you know. Look at, look at, look at these little guys. They're so, they're so perfect. And the more hearts you have with villagers, you get more cutscenes and you get to know them more. So yeah, I don't know, I don't remember if I ever actually said that or not. No, I think we've given up on tutorial based commentary a while ago. <laughs> yeah, you'll figure it out. Yeah. The Let's Play plural title means BNI. Uh, it doesn't mean you guys, I'm sorry. Yeah, you guys are just also here. I think the festival starts at 9. Yeah! Let's go! Yeah! Our shoes are so... something. <laughs> yep. They should not have such cute furniture. It is so expensive. I think don't okay. spend our money on stuff now. We should get strawberry seeds because they're the best spring seeds. And we don't have enough time to grow them this year, but we could grow them next year. Okay. So Linus says, no one really talks to me, I just came here for the deviled eggs, and I'm never related to anything more. <laughs> I closed out of her speech bubble, but all of the eggs for this festival were laid by Marnie's chickens, and that's just wonderful. Yeah. Demetrius, I don't think eggs are that strange of a thing to eat. They have so much nutrients in them. I think it's a very good idea to eat eggs. Yeah, ever, we've been doing it for a very long time. You're a scientist, Demetrius. You should know better. Alex says I eat at least three eggs every day. Oh no. Oof. Fun fact, if you give Alex a raw egg, he'll eat it just, just the raw egg. <laughs> I try to eat at least three eggs every day. Gotta get all that protein. Oh, even the guy from the Adventurers Guild is here. Yay! Yeah! Uh, let's tell Mayor Lewis we're ready to start. Okay. It's time for the highlight of today's festivities, the annual spring egg hunt. Calm down now, kiddos! Man, he sounds like an old man. You're going to need all your energy if you hope to find the most eggs and take home the exclusive prize. Now, is everyone ready? I'm ready. Yeah, let's go. Let's go! Okay, okay, we gotta get the egg hunt strategy. I to have- To clarify, I do not have a strategy, I just am trying my best. I also don't have a strategy, but I already have an egg. Oh, you already have two. Okay, maybe no strategy is not a great strategy. Turns out there's a lot of eggs in the graveyard. Hmm. This would have been much more entertaining from your screen. Yeah, you just have to run around as fast as you can. Well, the problem is I'm running around and running into stuff. Hmm. No. I saw Abigail two more. If only he could get the kids to pick up the trash this efficiently, he'd have a clean town. And now the winner of this year's egg hunt is B. <gasps> I get a silly hat! Yay! Look at my hat! Wait, I gotta see your hat. Oh, it's a wonderful hat! Yeah! Not getting heat stroke with this hat. Yeah! Aww, Marmalade's sleeping in my bed again. Aww. I may have won the egg hunt, but Marmalade won our hearts. Well, I would walk 500 miles and I would walk 500 more just to be the man who walked a thousand miles to 
fall down at your door.